I have got some really cool applications to share with you today and you probably won't find most of them on Google Play Store because they are Android specific which means they are open source completely free have no advertisements and most importantly they respect your privacy When you talk about Android Maps in general there's one application that normally comes to mind which is Google Maps but if you are looking for something lighter more private and just a bit different Co Maps is worth checking out it's open source does not collect any sensitive information and it's very light on your device so it will not drain your battery like crazy the interface is clean and pretty familiar so you will get used to it very quickly but what really makes it special are these amazing features first it lets you download maps for offline use which is super helpful if you are traveling or in a low network area just tap on the menu go to download maps pick your region and you are done you can also search for things like restaurants grocery store those ATMs just like you do on Google Maps. Navigation also works great with voice directions built in. You will also find some really cool features like saving bookmarks, recording your tracks and simple backup tools. And yes, it has both light and dark mode with different styles and layers. This application is continuously receiving updates, so you can expect more awesome features to be added soon. Next up is something I have been thinking to talk about for a long time. It's called Round Sync. Now, this one might look like a normal file manager at first glance, but it can do much more than that if you dig a little bit deeper. I really like the interface of this application, which is very clean and minimal. But the real magic starts when you tap the plus icon at the bottom. That's where you can start adding your favorite cloud storage services. Yes, it supports quite a few of them. On the left side menu, there's a whole automation section where you can schedule file synchronization, set up custom triggers, and fine tune how you want your files managed. There's also a settings section where you can change the look and feel of the application, manage file permissions, and a lot more it's kind of like an all in one file manager that also doubles as a cloud sync tool if you are still using the default file manager on your phone this could be a great upgrade now let's talk about something a little more fun it's a flashlight application called lumo light Now you might think why do I need a flashlight application my phone already has one Lumo light is not just a basic flashlight it is fully customizable and has a lot of cool features so first it can use the regular rear flashlight on your phone like any other application but it can also turn your screen into a front facing flashlight with different colors this is super useful if you are in the dark and need a softer light from the front or if you just want a cool visual effect one of the best things is the quick access tile in your status bar once you enable it you don't even need to open the application just pull down your notification panel and toggle the flashlight instantly now here's where it gets interesting you can choose different flashlight colors for the screen set how long the flashlight should stay on adjust the brightness level and even control how fast the flashlight blinks using bpm blinks per minute the last one is especially fun for creating strobe like effects also this application is available both on android and google play store but there might be some compatibility issues between these two versions so you can either pick the android version or the google play store version so if you like applications that are simple but give you more control and extra features look Lumo light is definitely worth trying. Moving on to the fourth application. It's called Air and it's a really interesting one. This application is actually a private storage utility for Android. Think of it like a secure locker on your phone where you can store all your important files that no other application can access. Let me quickly show you how this application works. When you open Air, it looks just like a basic file manager. You will see a list of your internal storage folders on the left side, just like any regular file manager. You can copy any file, a photo, video, document, anything and paste it inside Air. And once you move a file into Air, no other application on your phone can access it it's completely isolated you can also add a password to protect the application so even if someone gets access to your phone they still won't be able to see what's inside air without that password air also gives you a quick tile in the notification panel kind of like a shortcut you can turn that on by editing your status bar tiles when that is done just long press the tile go to application settings and set up your password super simple so if you have any files that you want to keep private without using any cloud services or third party applications air is an excellent option and finally my favorite one from today's list shorts studio if you take a lot of screenshots on your android phone like i do you know how messy things can get scrolling through the gallery trying to find that one screenshot from last week or last month can be very annoying and that's where shorts studio comes in this application is designed specifically to manage organize and clean up your screenshots and what's really cool is that it uses ai to do most of the work for you and while you do need an api key to make it work properly this application gives you easy step by step instructions to set it up you don't need to be technical it just takes a couple of minutes now let's talk about what this application can actually do first it can automatically tag and categorize your screenshot using AI which makes searching for something super fast it lets you create custom collections or folders to organize screenshots you also get batch tools to delete duplicates clean up unwanted shots and manage multiple screenshots at once this is going to save you a lot of time and the best part it's completely free 
open source and has no advertisements. Honestly, it is one of the best applications I have seen for handling screenshots and you should definitely give it a try. And that's all for today's video. Please let me know your favorite application from today's list. And if you have any recommendations, please drop them in the comments below. And if you enjoyed this video, don't forget to like and subscribe for more amazing content. Thank you so much for watching. I'll see you in the next one.